I've heard about you. You're helping people around town, right? So, any news? Have you tried talking to Marae at all? She told us that she had some information to share. Marae? As in THE Marae? The town gossip? I chased her for days begging for info, but she wouldn't give up a single scrap! So how'd you get the old bird to talk? This old bird had a change of heart, that's all. Then quickly, before you have another, tell us! What do you know about the notorious angel of the slums? Has she struck again? Is that it? I don't know anything about that. But I do know where her hideout is. Her base of operations? Now that's a scoop! Where is it? Tell me! Deep in the scrap, at Lookout Point. Hardly anyone goes out there these days. It's the perfect place for a criminal to hold up. Lookout Point! Got it! I'll check it out right now! But before you go, I should warn you about this rumor I heard. About a terrible fiend that's claimed the Angel's hideout as its lair. Oh, quite large. Lots of teeth. Always hungry. I don't know about you, but I'd not go anywhere near that thing. Oh, well, uh... <clears throat> well, a good reporter knows never to take foolish risks. Uh, plan first, then act. That's every respectable journalist motto. If it's a plan you're looking for, I'd say you have one right here. Wouldn't you? So, my good mercenary, if I might impose upon you again, it would be lovely if you investigated Lookout Point for me. You're dead. Let's go. Let us through, or else. Shock 
Okay, up and at him. Okay. Should look around. The guardian angel of the slums will collect your offering on behalf of the poor. This must be one of her calling cards. I don't see anything else interesting. Let's head back and tell him what we found. one of her calling cards this is the genuine article I'm sure of it pinned by the angel herself hmm. so this is one of her famous warnings it's an incredible find oh was that all hold on looks like there's something else a message to the nosy Shinra reporter sniffing around I was planning to teach you a lesson you would never forget However, by the grace of your mercenary friend, you were spared that lesson. But next time, he might not be around to save you. You would be wise to watch your step. Not just a message from the Angel. A warning. 
If the Merc here hadn't bailed you out, that fiend in the scrap would have ripped you to shreds. <sighs> Sorry about that, friend. Here I was, just trying to help you out. But instead, my kindness almost got you violently killed. Now, now. <laughs> no harm, no foul, right? In any case, I hope this narrowly averted tragedy won't discourage you from sharing information with me in the future. Hey, everybody! The angel left another calling card! She's gonna rip off Don Corneo! It's about damn time! Don Corneo's no easy mark! I can't wait to see how this goes down! Excuse me, I'm a reporter for the Daily Buzz and... So much for my reward. Here, why don't you take this? Oh, and no need to thank me. Let's just say it slipped out of that reporter's bucket. <laughs> Can't call it theft if you're just claiming what you're owed. Am I right? Well done, Mr. Merck. You certainly lived up to your reputation. We probably ought to call it a day. Getting late, huh? You've been working so hard you lost track of time. Had to. The pace sucked. Because they didn't know if you were worth it yet. But now they do. Come on, let's go home. Hello, Aerith. What do you want? Haven't seen him before. He your new boy toy? He's my bodyguard, if you must know. Wait a minute. Those eyes. Is he the one who beat up Reno? And what if I am? Need to cross my T's, dot my I's, that's all. Cloud, leave him be. Rude's not a bad person, really. No, I'm not bad. But like it or not, I sometimes have to do bad things. <sighs> Don't take it personal. You Turks are all the same. All bark, no bite. You're one to talk. Why don't You've you got this. Nap? No need to get rough. Can't keep eyes. <laughs> Let's do this. <laughs> Try me. Enough! Let's try that again. You gotta get a little payback for my partner. Come on, then. Soldier power. First class. You jittery? Hey! 
I got your number. that I have. Can't. It's my job. Then think about changing careers. Leave us alone. You know I can't do that. <clears throat> hey there, partner. Huh? I'm but, sure you're uh, having the time of your uh, life, but we're needed on standby uh, for a job. It's something uh, about Sector 7. Uh, so get your ass back here now. Understood. Got somewhere else to be? Apparently so. Go home and stay there. You know I can't do that. Huh? <laughs> 